Yeah, you, know, you can just feel the buzz of this city all day long, and we are seconds away now for this opening face-off. This is what you play for. Moments like this, you can feel the energy in this building, and we are underway. Trying to shake loose. Denies him on the breakaway. Tries to get it to Martin. Carries the puck through the neutral zone. And that's the play by Morrissey. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Winnipeg's got it along the wall. And he takes the feed. I don't think anybody was hanging on to the puck after that hit. And he takes the pass. Here's a chance! Big time stop! There's the whistle as the puck stopper elects to hang on. Pelovic's known for getting in the groove when he faces a lot of shots, guys. His one more zone ability means he stays engaged to give his team a chance to win. Toronto's got it in the offensive zone. Here he is, wrestling on that. Played big in the moment there. Well, this is an incredible save, James. It's anticipation as well. Recognize that the shooter is in the low slot, getting in front of it and making the save. Too much congestion blocks the shot. Toronto's got the puck in the defensive end. Some solid defensive work in their own end with the poke check. Winnipeg's on the attack. Can hang on to the puck after taking a knock. And he sends it across to Domi. Toronto's got it in the offensive zone. Moves it to the middle. Great defensive heads up play to pick it off. Great use of the stick in the defensive end by Klingberg. Takes the feed. With possession along the wall. The Jets scoop it up along the boards. As a goaltender, you want to make yourself as big as possible, and that's exactly what he does right there and just takes away the net. Winnipeg's got the puck in their own end. Made the stop on the play. Here's a short pass to Giordano. Stopped by the goaltender, getting a piece of that one. Moves it to Appleton. The Jets take it across the line. Tosses it to Kempf. Drills them. Winnipeg's got a hold of it along the wall. Great poke check on the reach. Forces the turnover in the defensive zone. Oh, did he ever rock him in the open ice? He knew exactly what he was doing with that hit this early in the game. He's trying to send a message and dictate the pace. Along the boards, they battle for the puck. Winnipeg's got possession of the puck. Takes the puck. And that's broken up in the defensive zone by Barron. The Leafs look to start the transition game. Moves it around along the half wall. He scores! What a goal! Well, he's in tight to the net, James, and he knows that he's not going to have much time or space to get it off, so he elects to use the snapshot and beats the goaltender. Toronto's got to be feeling good about their game tonight. Here they already lead in this one, and they've been dictating the pace of play also. Well, they get the game's first goal midway through the period, James, but I liked their game right from puck drop. I mean, the way that they started, the urgency around the puck, they pounded it, they've had a heavy forecheck, and now they get rewarded for their efforts. Oh, and he whiffs on it. The Jets gain control of it. Ehlers moves the puck and loses possession after a solid hit. Scores! They're striking quickly. Two goals in 50 seconds, James. Anybody who just got up for a quick snack is probably looking at the scoreboard going, what happened? Well, don't blink. The game can change in an instant. Absolutely. And you get these great A scoring chances nice and tight to the net. You got to find a way to convert on it, but you have to be aware of where the goaltender is. You don't have much time. You have to have quick hands, but you have to find the back of the net when there's not much room. Toronto's extended the lead to two goals here in the first. Now you can certainly see that there's jump to their step. They have their legs underneath them, and they've really dictated pace and controlled the game. The Jets take control of the faceoff. And it's a quick pass to Ehlers. And the goal 
goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. The key to being a great goaltender is not giving up second shot opportunities, and it's playing the rebounds to the corner. He does an excellent job here. The Leafs play it along the way. He grabs the puck here at the point. The Leafs have it now. Slides it on over to Matthews. Winnipeg's looking to break out of their own end. Forces the turnover. Skilled use of the stick to poke the puck away. And he slides it quickly to Iofalo. Oh, he just got thunderstruck. Well, he did. I mean, closing so quickly. No time and space there and just crushes him. What a hit. Back to the blue line. Here's a chance. Nowhere for that shot to go through. Scrum along the boards. Taken along the wall by Pionk. And he slides it quickly to Velarde. Moves the puck into the attacking area. Reads it perfectly, breaking up the play. The Jets take over on possession. Now a quick pass to Schmidt. Here they come. And he takes the feed. And now he moves it quickly to Velarde. Slides it back to the blue line. And that shot dies in traffic. Fires it. Shuts it down with the paddle. What a stop. Oh, what a violent collision there. He just got railroaded. Closed space so fast and just taken down. Along the boards, they battle for the puck back and forth. Find some space in the corner. And they come up with it as the puck skips out. Unleashes a cannon. The lane was plugged up and that shot's blocked. Great use of the stick at center by Barron. The Leafs carry it along the wall. Oh, he's going to feel that the rest of the game. They are wearing down their opponents with hits like that. Strong defensive effort. Toronto's got it in their own zone. Up along the wing. And that pass goes off a stick. Final minute approaching here in this opening frame. Feeds it to Barner. Inside the defensive zone, moving the puck. Pass out front, and he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Made that stop. Denies him! Man, is he ever quick on his feet, anticipating the play. Excellent reflexes. He's saving his team right now. Elam is playing with such confidence right now, and he's got this point streak going, and when that's happening for you, you're having a ton of fun putting up the points. Toronto's won the draft. Now let's see what they can do with it. Period number one in the books. First intermission entertainment is on deck here. You can also have time to go grab a drink, grab a hot dog, and we'll be back with period number two in moments. Period number two is about ready to go. Second frame is underway as the puck is dropped. Well, Cheryl, we got 20 minutes under our belts in this one. How do you sum up the performance? Hello, Bucks have been outstanding in the first period, James, and really the only reason this game is close. This is exactly why you build your team from the goaltending position out. Slides the puck over to Morrissey. Strong defensive effort. And it's a quick pass to Ehlers. How did he stop that one? Great heads up play to poke it away in the offensive end. Oh, he got hit by a great thunderous collision. Look at the end result. He's on his own bench. Yeah, and this is tough to handle whether it's on your opponent's bench or yours. You know why, James? It's because you weren't able to stand your ground and now you're over the boards. Way too much congestion blocks that. Toronto's got it along the wall. In close! Big time save! Oh my goodness! Well, throw technique out the window. This time it's all about the competitive will to get to that puck. Good check, freeze the puck up. Here's an odd man rush. Sends it over. Toronto's looking to break out. And it's kicked away. Toronto's got a hold of the puck now. Tries to get the puck over to McCabe. 
The Jets played along the boards. Shot! Scores! The Jets are flying tonight! He's in a high danger scoring area. He's got a bit of time, but he knows he's going to have coverage come to him right away. So a quick snapshot, and he buries it. The Jets finally have something to build on here in period number two. That's one of the only shifts this period where they drove the net and they've attacked James. They've got to find a way to possess the puck and get more shots on net. They've been outshot this period. Taken by Giordano. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Oh, and it stays out. He got a piece of that one. Moves the puck. Toronto's got control of it now from their own end. Scooped up along the wall by Brody. With the puck inside the defensive zone. Broken up by Dillon. Quick feed to Niederreiter. Moves inside! Denies him! That's a fantastic save by the goaltender, but his team has to do a better job of protecting the middle of the ice. Those high danger scoring chances eventually go in. period left to play. Winnipeg still down a goal here, but they have really picked up the tempo these last few minutes. Yarncroft's got it, and they'll go on the attack here in the offensive zone. Made the save on the play. Into the offensive zone. Good heads up defensive play as he extends the stick. Gives them nothing in front. Feeds the puck to Yarncroft. Moves it quickly over to Kale. A shot. Oh, what a great glove save on the play. The Leafs will be tough to beat tonight if they continue to play the way they have been. Really active in the offensive zone. And they win the offensive zone faceoff, and here we go. Oh, what a save on the clapper. The Jets have it now. Looks to pass it to Chisholm. Moved up ahead here in the neutral zone. Grabbed along the board by Riley. The Leafs take the puck through the neutral zone. And makes the save. Hellebuck's been dominant in the crease tonight. He's turned away a lot of high danger shots and he's really found a way to build some momentum for his team, giving him a real opportunity to win. Came up with the save on that play. And that's intercepted by Wilgren. Tried to pick the corner and missed it up. Oh, and there's so many things that he does well here, James. He fights for the interior of the ice, and he gets a great look and just misses wide. More than half the period has gone by. Hope you're enjoying this one. The Leafs lead it 2-1 in what has been an entertaining game thus far. A chance! And that goes off the body. Answered the call on that play. It's always a challenge to make a save when there's tons of traffic in front of you, but he does a great job of tracking and staying dialed in and makes the save. Officials have got both teams ready, and looks like play is set to resume here. Shifley's won the face off deep inside the offensive zone. by the goaltender to redirect it to the corner, getting it out of danger. Toronto's done a nice job of generating pucks on net, and as a result, they lead here in the second. They take possession as he locks them up off the faceoff. Quick pass to McCabe. Slides the puck across to Domi. Oh, look at this. Here they come. They've got numbers. 
The Leafs have it behind the cage. And he comes up with it. There's the whistle. We'll get a face-off after the goalie covers up. And they win the draw in the offensive zone, and they go to work. Oh, denies them with the paddle save. The goaltender is very aware of where that puck is in that low slot area and defends his crease by getting out, being aggressive, and taking away any of the net. Past the halfway mark of this period, Toronto's got a slim lead. They lead it 2-1. And now it's grabbed by Pionk. Morrissey's moving it ahead. And he slides it quickly to Ayafalo. And lowers the boom with a big-time hit. Wow, this is a message-sending hit, isn't it? When you get all of your opponent and you're able to separate the body from Buck, you know you've done your job. Message delivered. The Leafs continue to put lots of pucks on net here, and they lead it late in the second. Toronto's going to start with the puck in their own end. Here they come inside the neutral zone. The Jets have it against the wall. Great pass from the left wing. Toronto's got the puck. Works it across to Yarncroft. Knocks the puck away in the open ice. Can't hang on to the biscuit after that. Winnipeg's got a hold of the puck. Big hit, and that frees up possession. Scores! Having another look at it on the replay, we can see that he got a piece of it, but just not enough, and it squeaks through to the net. Toronto's now gone up by two here in the late goings of the second, and this is a nice place to be here, Cheryl. It's exactly where they want to be, and they won't want to sit back. They'll want to continue to push right through to the end of the period. They've got that nice, healthy cushion. They don't want to give it away. Fires it into the offensive zone. Passes on over to Nemestikov. Look out, here they come on the attack. Shot, stopped by the goaltender. Sends a pass over. Steps in front of that one. Quick feed to Perfetti. Drives to the paint. Oh, he kind of struggled with that one, but he got just enough to keep it out. They go on the attack through center. Picked up along the wall by Krager. Carrying the puck deep inside his own end. Redirected off a stick. From the back of the cage with the puck. Toronto's been bringing the heat offensively all night long, and they continue to lead here late in this middle frame. And they take possession. Nice job tangling him up on the draw. Here's a short pass to Shifley. Take the shot! And that pass is redirected. 40 minutes to play in the books. Both teams will get one last chance to catch their breaths, and then it's on to period number three next. And we are just moments away from the start of the third period. Well, the moment of truth for both teams here as we are underway in the third. The Jets gain control of the puck. Picked up along the boards by Morrissey. Picking up momentum across the zone here on the right side. Tease him up, denies him on the one-timer. Take it along the wall by Wilgren. Quickly to Matthews. 
through the neutral zone up along the wing. On the attack along the boards. Nice reflex by the goaltender to get his glove on that one. He reads this play perfectly, James. He gets tight to the shooter. There's no room to put it by him. The Leafs have put a lot of pucks on net, and as a result, they lead it early in this third period. The Jets win it in the defensive zone. Slides it to Velarde. Winnipeg's got the puck against the half wall. Good use of the body on the play. Moves it quickly over to DeMello. The Leafs gain possession in their own end. The Jets gain possession along the wall. Niederreiter's got it in the offensive zone. That's gloved by Sam Sodoff. Still plenty of time left in this frame. Been a pretty good offensive display, at least for one side. 3 1 is where we sit. And that carries off a body in the lane. The Leafs will play it in their own end. Passes ahead from the right side. Rocks him on the play. Takes the feed from the wing. Passes it up ahead. Takes a shot. Oh, that hits the cage. That's using your head. Well, he was dialed in to make the save with his mask, James, but I don't know how that... Oh, what a save! He stopped it! Whoa! Well, that's an intangible effort that you can't teach, James. That's all about desperation and the will to stop that puck. That's gloved by Hellebuck. Now a quick pass to Shifley. Reaches out and uses the stick. Great reach by Yonko. The Jets cross the blue line and are on the attack. Bumped off the puck. The Leafs gain possession. Scooped up along the wall by Kent. Quick pass to Ehlers. Takes the feed. There's a great glove saved by Samsonov. The Leafs have continued to put lots of pucks on net, and they lead it here in the third. Yarncrox won the draw deep in the defensive zone. Levels him with the hit. Winnipeg's moving it up the ice. Quick feed to the Mr. Oh, the Save to keep his team alive. Such an impressive save, James. I love to look at these ones again because it's not just being in great position, it's being desperate. It's finding a way to get to the puck, keeping your eye on it at all times, tracking it, out battling and out willing everyone around you. Nearing the midway mark of the period, it's a two goal lead we're looking at with the score 3 1. The Leafs win the draw. Here's a short pass to Reeves. Brings the puck into the offensive end now. Here's a pass to the middle. Moves it again. And he'll hang on to it to regroup here for a moment. Tenacious battle for the puck along the wall. Winnipeg's got a hold of it against the wall. Into the offensive end now. Great reach with the poke check. Grabbed along the board by Reeves. Scoops up the puck here. Winnipeg's got the puck. A wicked pass! And the long-range shot goes off target. He really bared down on his stick on that one. He got the velocity behind it, but it was nowhere near the net. Along the boards, they battle for the puck. Puck leaves the zone on the bad pass, and they'll be forced to regroup. What pressure here in the offensive end. And the base got it in the wrong end. And finally, they get it out of the road. And here they go in transition. Denied that one. Stops him again. Man, James, he shows incredible quickness right there as he makes one and then the second save. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. Moves it to Morrissey. There's a shot. And the puck dies with the trapper save. A big face off here inside the offensive end. Toronto's got a hold of the puck. 
And he's pulled over to the ice and loses the puck. The Leafs scoop it up along the boards. The Jets take possession in the defensive end. And now he moves it quickly to Matthews. Oh, an unbelievable stop by Hellebuck. There's another stop. Hellebuck's going to hang on to the puck and get a stoppage in play. Nothing gives confidence to a team more than a big save, and he's been doing it all night, James. The Leafs have been a lot of fun to watch tonight. Lots of offensive scoring chances, and they have capitalized late here in this third. Puck picked up by Ayafalo. Loses his balance on the play. And uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. The Leafs take it along the wall. Turns that one away. The Leafs gain control of the puck against the wall. And it's a quick pass to Giordano. Blocked in traffic. Takes a shot. Turns it aside with the glove. Goaltender hangs on for the whistle. A critical draw here. And they win the draw. Now let's see what they can do with it. Nice puck check inside the attacking zone. And he slides it quickly to Connor. The Leafs pick up the puck here in the neutral zone. Takes the pass as he banks it off the wall. Picked up along the boards by Brody. The Leafs will play it from the defensive zone. It certainly is, and if you're the opponent, man, oh, man. your head's going to be on a swivel. You're going to be knowing when he's coming. Stop! Stay clean. They saw him. They took advantage of the rebound and scored. This is actually a tougher play than it looks, James. You have to have timing and an awareness to be able to get your stick on that rebound and then bury it. Not a lot of time and space available, but he executes perfectly. The Jets desperately needed something and they finally made it happen. Now they're in the final frame here, but they got one back and you know what that's like as an opponent when you know that that team is coming and they're a wave. There's a lot of urgency and they're a dangerous team right now. From the left side takes the pass. Tavares plays it now. They need a goal here. They've got the extra attacker out on the ice. Moves it quickly over to Lilbrick. Wide open net. Misses. Dylan's got it in the defensive end. Quick pass to Velarde. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. Feeds the puck across to Domi. That's just a great heads up read at center ice. And that's all she wrote on this one as we are in the books. And with the victory, the series lead now shifts to a 2-1 advantage on their side. I really like the response in their game to break the tie in this series and get ahead 2-1, James. It's all about habits, finding ways to apply pressure to your opponent. And now with that lead, you have applied pressure. So if you can get the next win, man, game four is going to be interesting. Well, that'll do it for tonight's postseason action, but the playoffs roll on, and we will see you at the next game. From all of us here at EA Sports, I'm James Sabalski. Good night.